when we look at your educational history, I mean, you started as a pre-med and then you got a degree in music education. Uh, here you were not thinking about being a singer into your early mid-twenties and at the age of 30, you're making a debut as a Metropolitan Opera star baritone and you're never looking back. So something happened in the middle of your 20s. Um, what, what was it? What was it? Well, there was, no, there was no one thing, obviously. First of all, we have to back up because I'd always thought about being a singer. Did I know what an opera career was or singing at the Met? And I heard the broadcasts on Saturday afternoon and would listen to Delmonico Warren and Richard Tucker, you know, with whom, of course, I sang many times. I would hear these people. I was not the dreamer type. That is, I would hear a broadcast and think, mark my words, someday I'm going to be there. I wasn't, I wasn't that type. Uh, I was better at the small steps. Well, and, and, and a mistake that people make in aspiring to some career, whatever it is, not just necessarily just singing, they dream, and it's great to dream, but if you only dream, it's not going to happen because it's always two blocks away, and in five years, it's still two blocks away, and in 10 years, it's two blocks away, rather than the small steps. 